when I think of beauty, I like to think of not conventional standards, but what people think about the way that people's lives should be organized, people's you know, inner sense of what other people are about. Um, like for me, that's more important than what people look like or how people act. Now, do you believe that people, on how they look, that they tend to judge other people based on appearance? I think that a lot of people do, uh, but I think that's because of that's the way that you know, the media, society, that's the way that people are conditioned to look at other people. Um, do you personally, in a situation, would you tend to uh, be nicer to a person who you think is more attractive than another individual would be? Um, I'd hope I wouldn't. Thank you. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Treat someone better or nicer if they were more attracted than another person. What do you consider in today's society to be beautiful? Just to be yourself, I guess. Features such as hairstyle, um, the way your body shape, color tone on a person. Do you think that has to do with anything on how people judge other people? Um, okay, in today's society, do you feel that one person will judge someone else based upon their looks or upon certain features that they possess? Yes. How so? Um, some people will hang out with certain people if they don't dress the way they dress them. What about the jobs? Would you personally um, treat someone better or nicer if they were more attractive than another person? Thank you. Consider beautiful as in feature wise. Feature wise? Um, well, I don't know that I would necessarily define beauty as necessarily features. I think it's kind of like more like comes from the inside. Oh, okay. So, at what age is considered beautiful? What age do you consider someone beautiful? Um, I think that there's a problem in our society that young, yet like youth, is considered really beautiful, and like when you get older. Are considered beautiful, and I think those standards are unrealistic. 
And I think that um, all people can be beautiful. You just kind of have to look at them in a certain way. Okay, so how do you think your view of beauty influences the way you treat people? Like, have you ever discriminated against someone that you thought was ugly? Um, I think generally speaking, I don't. I think there's a real peer pressure culturally when I kind of like when you're like out, like if you're single, kind of looking for people. I think there are like that's the most part for the most part where I might kind of get pressured into cultural ideas of beauty. Have you ever considered um, dogs beautiful? Yeah. So, have you ever considered people looking like these dogs? Like people looking like dogs? Do you ever say like, oh, she looks like? Oh no. Okay. Um, do you believe that all babies are beautiful? Yeah. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, do you discriminate against people who look a certain way? Would you be more friendly with someone that you believe is beautiful than someone you believe is ugly? Yes, because somehow uh, the the thing of innocence, you know, uh, makes them very beautiful. Yes, and and they're beautiful. Um, yeah, very much. So. Okay. And where do you remember first learning about beauty? Where do I first remember first learning about beauty? Um, okay. Um, I think when I was very young and and kind of admiring something of nature, perhaps, you know, is, is like my first memory of seeing something that was very beautiful, you know? Okay, and how did it feel? Uh, it felt good. It felt really good. Uh, it's kind of those moments when you watch a sunset and it feels really good. Okay. Um... What do you think influences your opinions on beauty? I guess to a certain amount, what we see on TV surely influences everybody, I think, or magazine ads and such. But I think beauty, real beauty, comes from within. Uh, it's not the physical beauty. It's, it's what's inside people that's most beautiful. 
Okay. And how much do Western standards shape your preferences? Um, <laughs> uh, I believe in one world. So it, every influence there is all over the world would influence whatever preferences I have about beauty. Okay. How do you think your view of beauty influences how you treat people? Um, it, it surely does because um, along with beauty comes kindness and other virtues like that. Okay. And if someone was from a remote island that was untouched by the outside influences, do you think they would have the same perception of beauty? Oh, uh, yes, of course I do. I think because if one understands beauty comes from within and then it's a certain feeling you get when you see certain things of nature or something within another human being, uh, there's something to appreciate and see beautiful in everybody. So I think that's that, that's part of mankind. Okay, thank you. Yeah, is that good? Yeah. This is my lens is good. Thank you. Good. Told that was beautiful. Um, that always look at somebody for their 
and their appearance is not the outside because they could be smart and everything on the outside. But I mean, they could be beautiful on the outside, but the inside they could be dumb and have a nasty attitude. Okay, and do you think it changed? Yeah, kind of. Um, features or anything? Um, Feature-wise, eyes, lips, and nose. So, how do you think your view of beauty influences how you treat other people? Are you nice to people that you think are attractive or...? No, I'm nice to anybody in general. If they're ugly or beautiful, it doesn't matter. So, what parts of your body are considered to be beautiful? Like, um, not your body, but any body's body. I'll have to say that your eyes are never too Okay, so, um, do you consider all babies to be beautiful? Most babies. Okay, and um, what do you think the results of these beliefs, of like who is beautiful in society, what do you think are the results of these beliefs? I'm not sure. Okay. And um, do you consider dogs beautiful? Have you ever looked at a dog and compared it to a human being? Do you mind listing those kind of dogs? Pitbulls, chihuahuas, <laughs> Doberman pitchers. <laughs> okay, thank you for your time. Okay, so what do you consider beautiful as a teacher? Like physical? Bright eyes, um, and I think a really expressive mouth is beautiful, and high cheekbones. Okay, so what do you think influences your opinion on beauty? I think it is partly, you know, the images that I see around me, like in magazines, on TV, and in movies, and stuff like that, but I also think that it's, um, uh, maybe, you know, what I if I see something that's unusual, then I tend to think it looks more beautiful. Okay, and have you ever judged someone based on how you think they look? Like you treat someone better because you think they look more attractive? I would hate to think that I did do that, but I bet I have done. Okay.